Greetings, this is Jim Koppel with The Legacy Project. Policing, or specifically police, continued to dominate our news cycle. 800,000 law enforcement officers and 18,000 departments and nearly a million police community contacts every day. Recently, in facilitating a conversation about police reform, a civil rights attorney and advocate made the argument, we get the police we create. What police do in our communities is exactly what we ask them to do or expect them to do. Historically, police in the South emerged from slave patrols pursuing runaway slaves because we wanted them to capture the runaway slaves and return them to slavery. During Jim Crow, we wanted our police to keep our bathrooms and our water fountains segregated. During the war on drugs, we wanted our police to keep drugs off the streets, and we do that by over-arresting African-American males. Of the 2.3 million people incarcerated in the United States, 58% are either black or Hispanic, and they together constitute nearly 30% of the population. Get it? Police are what we have created. You want different police? Then help reimagine policing for your community. What kind of policing do you want? What do you expect police to do? Before you jump out and indict police for what they are currently doing, just know you are indicting yourselves. In my career, if I find racism in police departments, it is because I find racism in the community. What is it that Pogo said? We have met the enemy, and he is us. Recently, I was working in a community where a black school board candidate was canvassing for office in an affluent and, yes, white neighborhood. In one day, people in that neighborhood called the police three times to report a black man walking in the neighborhood. Police simply rolled their eyes, knowing that the call to police was coming from community members or a community member with racial bias. Think about it. How can you help reimagine policing for your community? We have an opportunity here. We have an opportunity to create the police that look like us. Is that a good thing or is that a problem? This is Jim Koppel with The Legacy Project.